Hey guys, Secret 1904 here, and where we last left off on Pokemon Yellow Mewtwo Simulator uh, was we got the Poke Flute. So, I guess the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go down here to. Actually, no. I know I'm doing the fast forward thing. I'm going to go to Celadon. So I can get Fly. Okay. Okay. Now then, who's? Oh, I could have, I could have gotten fly. Or, I don't know where I thought Snorlax was blocking right here. It's a Mankey, the pig monkey. I don't know if I need one. I didn't want to kill it. Crap. another monkey yeah got a monkey I have not been updating my notepad of my notepad deck I think I needed you all right I don't need you pretty sure I believe I need you I know I'm doing that thing where I'm fast forwarding. Okay, I don't think I need any more Pokemon there. Give me fly. I don't have room for it. Crap. You can learn fly. I know Mew can learn every move, but that's just kind of funny to think of. Also, am I the only one that thought like first gen Charizard was very underwhelming? Like, at least like in the early stages of him. Cause like, it, I'm pretty sure I taught it new moves, and Slash is still a move. It's a Squirtle. Do I have one? Now I have two. Okay. Uh, let me... I need to do something. I need to go... I really should just put... You up here. Switch you two for when I get... I don't think I need Flash anymore. Um, but I need to go to the Pokemon Center to put some items away and then like toss items and you know put items in here and and whatnot nope didn't want to go to bill uh, to bill's vc i wanted to go to tk's vc deposit don't need that anymore I don't think I need the lift key. I don't think I need the self scope. Let's just put all the TMs in there. You no, know let's just put everything in there, and then I'll pick pick them all out when I need them. Or I'll get them out now. So give me the Poke Flute. Give me the bike. Give me the... My Master Balls. Give me the Coin Case. Mm. 
I think that's all I need right now. I, mean, I technically don't need the bicycle, but I do need the bicycle at the same time. Uh, for what, Stormy? Pokey flu, pokey flu. Oh, Stormy, it's fine. You didn't know. Okay, I'm gonna give some context as to what we're talking about. Um, how did it come about? I, I forget why Stormy said it, but she called me Antoine, right? Uh. And obviously she didn't remember because I've only mentioned it once in, in our entire relationship. Um, that's what my great-grandma used to call me. And my great-grandma, I have the tattoo for her right here. You know, she has passed away since 2009. And I always get kind of sad whenever I hear the name Antoine because of it being like what my great-grandma called me. So, Stormy said it, I got, you know, a little sad last episode, and it showed. Uh, but Stormy, honey, you are completely fine, okay? I mean it, you are completely fine, okay? It, it, I'm sure stuff like that, stuff I've said like that is bound to slip up every now and then, or come out every now and then. So it's fine. I understand, honey. Oh, a bee drill. Too bad I can't breed in this game because I need a weedle. So is that what the other one's going to be a hump? Why are you humping me? I want to speed through all of these guys. Oops. I want to speed through all of these guys. And then I just want to have the fast to speed up. While it auto makes me go down. Isn't there an item somewhere over here? Yeah, I don't care about your Krabby. I thought there was like an item. I could be wrong. But so, in Pokemon Yellow, Red, and Blue, it auto makes you go down, right? So, I want to, first of all, got to see what's over here. A Nidorina. I needed you. That's why I caught the Nido Grand Female. Because I knew for sure I needed you. Okay, so, note to self, I cannot do the speed up and, and try and, um, I cannot do the speed up while I'm just pressing left and right. going to say is there any point of stopping me I need to go back and heal <laughs> Bells Bells bro no I don't need you no I don't need you definitely don't want you I think I didn't uh, but Stormy Boo, you're fine, okay? 
I'm not mad. I'm not upset. I'm not sad. It just brought back memory of my grandma. Or my great-grandma. A wild gas is here. I think I need you. I did not. Okay, I really need to just start looking at my list. Okay, I just want to see how fast I can go down there. Okay, you know what? That, that, that was a failed experiment. Then she got kind of brought up. But I don't have that really much memories of my great grandma. Like, uh, because I've only, like, I knew her, obviously. But, you know, it was so long ago when I actually saw her. Even, I mean, before, you know, she passed on. Because uh, she had been living with my grandma in, uh, in New York. So it, it had been a while since I had seen her. Um... You know, obviously I loved her. She gave me, you know, she gave me money as all grandmas do uh, for birthdays and yeah, just for birthdays. I think she always gave five dollars. I think that was her. Um, but, you know, I was always Antoine. Uh, my cousin Aaron was always sweet little Aaron. And I don't remember if my cousin Chris had any nicknames like that. I can't remember. Um, I remember being at one of my aunt's house, and she was there. She had a walker, and she had the tennis balls on her, on her little uh, walker, and I wanted to grab the tennis ball to play catch with my cousins. But obviously, for obvious reasons, you know, knowing what I know now, I couldn't because you know, they were uh, like cut in half in that. But, um, her favorite saying was live, laugh, and love. And, obviously, well, not obviously. Uh, it, well, no, yeah. When Before I got the tattoo of, you know, the rose with the angel wings, I thought of getting, like, a Triforce, because, you know, Zelda, Legend of Zelda. Um, I thought of giving live, laugh, love in Japanese. I thought of getting Live, Laugh, Love, um, you know, for her, for the tribute, because I got the tattoo like a year after she passed. Um, but obviously I went with what I have now, the, her name, her birth, her birth year, her death year, and the rose, the rosebud with the halo and angel wings. Um, I'm sure my grandma wouldn't mind if I were to do it. I think I sent one. It sent it to you, so I can just look that up. Do wake image. When did I? I know I sent it to you before, recently. Here it is. Open original and then. Save the image as, save. I'm gonna put the image of my great-grandmother here with uh, no, I, I'm proud of, like, I, I wasn't in this picture. I wasn't around this picture at all. I wasn't in New York at the time, but I'm proud of this picture because there are five generations. Now, as you can see, this picture was taken November 22nd, 2007. So there's five generations in this, in this picture. You got little Brianna, little BB, uh, BC1904 as I used to call her, uh, in the lap of my great-grandma, uh, Zelda. 
to the left of or on the left you got it goes my sister amber my grandma and then obviously mama tk um it's funny brie used to call her little gammy because you know brie's thing is gammy she doesn't say grandma she doesn't say grandmother she just says gammy so it's my mom is gammy my grandma is a uh, big gammy and my great grandma is a little gammy uh, and i think to this day brie still calls uh my grandma big gammy Yes, yes, uh, Stormy, Mum TK. If you ever go in my Twitch chat, you will, and if you ever see like uh, a name that is supposed to be Mama TK, but it's spelled M O M M T K, that that's my mom. Um, but um. Oh, hey, level fit. Wait, level 50? That's the level I am. I defeated Mark. I didn't even know Koga was level 50. Nice. But, um, yeah, my, my great grandma, you know, she was a sweet old lady. I still remember actually where I was, what happened when I learned of her passing. And I guess that's how much she meant to me. I, I may not feel it now because like I don't have any real memories of her. She did mean a lot to me. Uh, so it was way back in the day and I'm going to tell this story while I go to... I'm not going to go to the Safari Zone yet. I'm going to go go there next episode. I'm going to go over here to the right. Oh, it's a wild duo. Uh, so, it was back in the day, obviously the year 2009. Um, I was a senior in high school. And I believe the date was November... It might have been November 11th. And... I have a Bulbasaur, I don't need you. Um, I don't think I need you. I don't, definitely don't need you anymore. Uh, and I was on my way back from bowling. We were actually close to my house when my uncle got a phone. He was the one dropping me off uh, uh, from the bowling alley. And um, it was me in the back. I don't remember which one of the boys was in the back with me. If it was uh, Aaron or Chris. But it was one of us. And uh, I don't know who called my uncle, but someone called my uncle saying that she had passed away. And I probably would be would have been more sad about it. And I, I know that sounds you know messed up that I wasn't as sad. But I told um I remember texting one of the people who I knew, and, uh, yeah, literally the next day I asked this person out, so, TK had a girlfriend the day after his great-grandma passed, and to that girlfriend, because I know sometimes, or to that ex-girlfriend, uh, I do thank you for keeping my mind off my great-grandma. Because God knows I would have been so sad. Like, I would have been worse. Um, yeah. Anyway, guys, I'm TK1904. Be sure to comment, like, and subscribe to the channel. Be sure to stay safe, stay healthy, and as always, I'll see you all in the future. Bye.